Hello and welcome to Tom's Toolbox. I'm your host, Tom Clark, and today we're going to show you how to use the FLIR CM174 imaging clamp meter. Now, as you can see, I have already got on my PPE, so you know something is up. Now, this little puppy right here can show you exactly where an electrical problem is brewing, and it is the world's first clamp meter whoop, whoop, with built-in thermal imaging. I'm going to show you how that works in just a second. You see, it allows you to scan for overheating issues and hazards from a safe distance, letting you know if it's actually safe enough to make contact. The CM174 features IGM. It's the Infrared Guided Measurement. Now, the IGM visually guides you to a precise spot that needs further testing and investigation, and it does it with a laser. Now, this could be things such as an overheating connector, wire, cable, and then we're going to see right here in our battery-operated demo in just a second. If this was actually hooked up and plugged into some serious electricity, I'd have some big old honking electrical gloves on, but we don't need that for right now. All right, this also helps you catch unexpected issues that you might have missed without it, and the clamp lets you to access tight, hard-to-reach areas, and it's got a built-in light as well to make it easy to use. We're going to turn it on here. There's my light. All right, I can turn the light off. Now, it also has advanced electrical features such as true RMS, low Z, a VFD mode, inrush, and smart diode, and that's all your, your dial settings right here. So here we go. We're going to turn it on, and the way we do that is we just hold this blue button right here just for a second. We've got our little hourglass that pops up. It's loading our thermal imaging. There's our thermal imaging. We're going to get a temperature reading in just a second, and the temperature reading is going to come up right here, and it's going to tell us exactly which fuse is going to be a little bit hot. 102, it's well over 100, and you can see the crosshairs are right on top of that hot spot. Now I'm going to move it over, and I'm going to come to the other one. That's a lot lower. So you can, you can actually see that at 70 degrees, the image is not even showing up on our thermal imaging, but this one, you can see the color change right away. So there's a little bit of heat in there, and that's how you can tell that that fuse over there needs to get looked at. Well, that's going to do it for this edition of Tom's Toolbox. And as you can see, I'm actually being infrared checked out right now. Hopefully that's not a sniper scope on me. Remember, always wear the proper PPE for whatever the job calls for. Be sure to check out other videos with me, Tom Clark, as your host. And you just go to mihowto.com and they've got a ton of videos on everything. Thanks for watching today.